Color Guards, advance. Schools have celebrated Veterans Day with assemblies like this one for decades. Holy Family Catholic School in Coeur d'Alene had the music, the flag, and decorated veterans. But they added Skype. We honor our veterans today. Using internet technology, they spoke face to face with active military men and women in Baghdad this morning and learned firsthand about their service. Hi, I'm Emily. How do you feel about helping our country? Why is your job important? I feel honored. I feel proud. I feel proud to be over here tonight. Not just helping our country, but we're, we're rebuilding Iraq. The students were able to say thank you and learned a lesson in sacrifice. Hi, Dad. This is sixth grader Juliana Saltis. Her dad is Army Major Richard Saltis. He's one of the men in fatigues at the table. I just want to say to all of you, actually, thank you so much. I know how much I miss my dad. It was the first time she saw her dad since Christmas. He lives in Virginia and was deployed to Iraq in June, and they normally communicate via text and email. Sixth grade teacher Chris Lyons set up the Skype session to teach the students that service families should also be saluted. They're sacrificing their time with family. They're sacrificing um, just being away from, from our communities and everything for us, to protect us. When the assembly was over, Juliana got a few emotional minutes alone to talk to her dad, and both had to fight back the tears. This is why I don't like to talk to you like this. I hadn't seen him actually moving like that. Like, I've only seen him in pictures. Juliana hopes to fly back to Virginia and see him in January, and she knows Veterans Day is a day to honor veterans and their families. I try not to think about just my dad. I try to think about all the people like this, all the people that are actually like crying like I am right now. In Coeur d'Alene, Idaho, Eric Loney, KXY4 HD News.